Isolated at the juncture of the North Atlantic and the Arctic Oceans is the Nordic country of Iceland. Due to its location above a hot spot called the Iceland Plume, this country is rife with volcanic activity, hot springs, and geysers. Geothermal power is captured and distributed to houses across Iceland, covering 85% of the country's heat and electricity. There is a certain amount of trepidation that comes from living along the active western volcanic zone. That being said, the people of West Iceland have seen opportunities. For every three Icelandic people, there is one Icelandic pony. Outside Reykjavik, Becca Rist follows a lifelong dream as she shares her country on horseback with visitors each day. My, my family didn't have horses, but I know when I was four and we saw horses out in the field, I told my parents, you can leave me there and pick me up later. <laughs> and uh, so I, I wanted to be around these animals. So I was uh, 12 years old when I got my first horse. Now we have more than 40 horses. They are all different individuals. Bonding with a horse is among the most beautiful things you can do in your life. And get to know their character, how they are. And they are really, like they, they allow you to, to get to know them very well. Icelandic horses, when you look at them, you see they, they are smaller than many breeds. Their skills are the most important, that is the, the most, most important difference from other breeds. Because they, they are five-gated makes them really, really interesting, because most horses in the world are three-gated. And that can be really fast, as called flying pace. And some Icelandic horses can do that, and some can't. And really interesting to know that it was recently, actually, there was a team of Swedish and Icelandic scientists. They found the gene that makes the horse go the fifth gate. So if the horse carry this gene, they can do it. If they don't, they can. There are horseback riding trails all over Iceland and it's the best way to see them because you almost dance with the nature when you horseback ride through a beautiful, beautiful Icelandic landscape. There is like ice and fire and everything between. <laughs> Why? Perhaps it is the natural beauty, the tight weave of family combined with the looser appreciation and freedom for innovation. In a place where ice meets fire in an ever new and everlasting dance, what might you discover in Iceland?